Metro has been using drones for a while now, but are continuously finding new ways to use the technology to fight crime and keep our communities safe. Now, officials say the drones help officers go into dangerous situations they normally wouldn't be able to. It's an eye in the sky. Helping the Las Vegas Police Department fight off crime and enhance security in our community from hundreds of feet up in the air. It's a vital part of our strategy to save lives, enhance our response capabilities, and overall improve the service we provide our community. Chief Dory Corrin says Metro has been deploying drones and using them during large-scale events like F1 and the Super Bowl for years. But they have also used them to get real-time intelligence during shooting investigation, crashes, search and rescue operation, and SWAT calls. We're able to deploy a drone into a home or into a structure and be able to clear that area, limiting the physical contact between our SWAT officers and the armed individual. In many of those cases, because of that capability, we're able to save that person's life. And now they're expanding that capability with the help of Metro's new drones as first responders program, which equips patrol units with drones. And as they respond and arrive there, they're able to, de to, to deploy a drone from the back of their vehicle and instantly provide overwatch for our officers. Metro pilots will follow FAA guidelines and go through the department's own training before being allowed to fly in the community. Chief Corrin says the Department of Justice and Homeland Security have both evaluated Metro's drone policy. And they, their evaluation was consistent with what we wanted, which is that we have robust safeguards and we are being very measured and very smart about how we approach these new advanced technologies. Blue Filling Game believes the drones could help increase security in the community. Keeping the officers safe, keeping people safe, then I think it's a good idea. However, he adds that it could raise questions about the public's right to privacy. There has to be a line drawn where we're going to ensure that we're not going to make you feel like you're being invaded, that this is used for law enforcement, not to go and spy on you in your house. Metro says privacy is a top priority. We will make sure privacy, civil rights, civil liberties, and transparency are of equal importance. Metro says that the new drone program could help them save some money. For now, reporting from Metro's headquarters, I'm Giovanni Carrillo.